Hey guys, it's Jordan, and today is just kind of a lounge day, and I didn't really have anything to do. Um, so I decided to do a makeup collection video, kind of, and also a vanity tour. Um, now, I am going to say, first thing, I'm not trying to brag in any way about that. Um, for those of you who think that I'm just doing this video to brag, I'm not. I'm really not. Some people do like watching these kinds of videos, and if you're one of those people that don't like it, then why even search this? Okay, so right here, just, you know, this is a Tootsie Roll lunchbox kind of thing. I never used it as a lunchbox. It just has some nail products in there, like nail files and things like that. And I put my camera up here because I don't have a tripod. Hey, guys. Um, and here's this little pot that um, my mom got at Hobby Lobby. Because um, I needed, I was like, I need something for my makeup brushes. So she just purchased this for me. I'm not sure how much it was. But I just keep my brushes in here. There aren't very many, but, you know, it's what I got. Um, here is my mirror. Um, this is a picture of my dad and I. Just, I just keep it there. And this actually had a fragrance in it and just made my room smell amazing. And this is my notepad that I keep here, like, if I ever get an idea of a video to do or just products that I would love to purchase. So I just keep that there. And in here is this glass jar. I think this was also from Hobby Lobby or Michael's or you know, just any kind of place, um, and it just has all my nail polishes in it, stand up now, um, up here, um, this is actually brush cleaner, these are just my lotions that I use daily, the other lotions are under my sink in my bathroom, this is, um, a perfume, it's a slice of heaven, this is also a slice of heaven, I love this smell, this is a really good scent from Victoria's Secret. This is a perfume that I got for my birthday. It's just a body spritzer. And here I have just alcohol wipes to wipe my ears because I just got my double piercings. So I just have these in there. Um, this pot actually my friend made me in art camp. And I just have like samples of perfumes in there. And then some Vaseline, which is always good. Then in here, these are kind of, these are my, um, lip glosses and lip products that I use the most. I just have a little jelly pot from Wet n Wild from so long ago. Soft lips. Every person needs to have this. Um, this is my YSL. I got this as a gift from my mom for my birthday. It's really, really nice, and it's, like, running so well. I got it for my 12th birthday, I think. And then I just have, like, what other gurus call, like, um, drugstore brands. So I have L'Oreal, Gemma Kid, Wet n Wild from CoverGirl, Elf. My one MAC lip gloss that I got so long ago. I don't know if it's still in stock or if it's been discontinued. And then two um, Clinique um, lipsticks. And in here, I have lip products that I don't use that much. Just lip glosses, some Burt's Bees, like colored Burt's Bees. Um, you know, lip palettes and stuff that I don't like at all. It's just a little case that I usually keep in my purse, so I'll just... Yeah, toss it over there. Um, has my eyelash curler, some to-go brushes, a little mirror, some sponges, my tweezers, and just some other things in there. So that is that little, little container. And then down here, I keep a clipboard with um, pictures of, you know, makeup that I would love to try out. Um, just some notepads, extra notepads. And then back here, I was making my own um, brush cleaner the other day. That's what that was. I just decided to keep it all up here for when I run out. In this drawer, I keep all of my face products. So um, here's just some CoverGirl NYC and Stay Matte Mate, um, Rimmel foundations. And then here is, um, it has blush, two eyeshadows, and a bronzer set should actually go in another drawer. Two blushes from Revlon and Clinique, an NYC Sun to Sun bronzer, which is okay. Another foundation by L'Oreal. Um, I think this is a foundation. I really don't like it when it's in here for whatever reason. Um, an NYC concealer and a... Maybelline concealer. Then up in this drawer, I have my makeup removing wipes. These are just from Target, and I love these. It's up and up. Um, and these actually don't bother my face as much as, like, the name brand 
um, ones do. have some Q-tips in here and then some saline solution for my contacts. In here I have my deodorants um, and then two contact cases and some glasses. And then this one um, you'll see a lot, probably, maybe not. But I put it just right here when I do my makeup. Um, and then I keep this on my lap so that I can spot clean some brushes, but this is just so that I don't get stains, because I have a few stains up here. Um, here are all of my, like, palette things, or multiple sets, so I have, like, some quads in here, um, a multiple right here, a trio from the Forever 21 collection, it's kind of, like, I mean, their makeup isn't great, but, you know, it does the trick, you know, whatever, it stays on pretty long, actually. Um, this that I showed you earlier, it needed to be in here. And then an actual palette from the Color Workshop, which I really hate. And a, um, face palette that I also really hate. I don't like the Color Workshop at all, but my grandma gave it to me for the holidays, and I just keep it in here, and, like, sometimes I'll use the colors if, you know, I don't have a purple that I want to use, so I'll use, you know, another color in there. Don't like it, though. And then here, this is on my eyes, here's my glitter liners. Um, just because I didn't want to shove them in there, and I didn't want to leave an empty hole, so I just put that there. And then here I have my two mascaras that I use the most, because I, I'm not like one of, I'm not another, I'm not, blah, 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 erase that. I'm not like one of those people that keeps all of their mascaras just to make it look like they have a bigger mascara collection, because mascaras, here's the thing about them, they grow so much bacteria after six months, that if you use it after six months, you're just putting on all old, gross bacteria. So I have my favorite mascara here, which is the Great Lash Big, and then the normal Great Lash, which I don't really use, but I use it if, you know, I missed a spot. Like, I'll put it in the corner of my eyes, like, um, and on my bottom lashes. And here I have all my single shadows. I actually do have two MAC shadows. This is Vanilla, and this is Sleepy. I got them, like, when I was, like, nine after, like, a sorry, my camera just went really stupid, but this is some Stila Pigment, it's my only one, and I really, really like it, it's pretty, like, bronzish gold color, this is a beauty rush, um, it's not that great, like, when you use it, when you use the little, um, applicator that's in here, let me show you guys, difficult to do this with one hand, see, this applicator is not great at all, but, um, I didn't know this, until like a couple weeks ago this tipped over and I saw that look it's all pigmenty so this is actually a pigment believe it or not um so yeah and then I just have a roll-on from forever 21 which is not good at all don't buy it it came in like a little goodie bag at a party can't believe that we still do goodie bags but you know what I like them because you get free little goodies huh and then a bonbon one from so long ago and then in here are all of my eyeliners. I actually do have a MAC liner that um, my sister, my stepsister, didn't like, so she gave it to me. Um, and then this is not good at all. Do not buy this product. This is... who makes this? This is Wet n Wild. It is an eye wand. Had a shadow over here that she broke off, and an eyeliner right here that is okay. And I have my NYC Jet Black eyeliner. And then, actually, I don't think that this is the Forever 21 brand. Um, maybe it is. But this one's actually good. It's just an eyeliner from there. You know, it does the job. And then this is my little, this is my little mini Sephora <laughs> that I need to get another one of because it's running low. Like... This is the actual eyeliner. <laughs> so sad. So, oh, and then there's my trash cans. Gross. And then here I just keep all my eye products, and I usually put this in there, but since I'm making a video, it's up here. Um, these are my eye products. I have a mirror back there for when I do my hair. have a brush, some blow dryers, some hair protectant stuff, headbands, clips, flat irons, mom's baby flat iron, which I love, and then a little ring with all my hair ties on it. So that was my vanity slash makeup collection. I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, I'm not bragging and yeah, that's, that's it. Alright, bye guys.